just watched this vlog about it was a David So and I'm with my homie Kaz and uh Fuck. <laughs> we he, he was talking about going to Popeyes and getting that chicken sandwich and it was such a big hype and we were like damn we should get some chicken sandwiches but then <laughs> look at this line dude we're not even in the parking we're lot we're not yet. even in the parking lot <laughs> It's all true, like man. It's like wasn't it wasn't until like a month after till like everybody was like chilling about the whole hype on chicken sandwiches, mm. and we're able to finally get one. It would just be like all sold out. It was all the hype. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, those chicken sandwiches what came out? Was it this year or was it 2019? You, I don't even know, dude. I no, no, I, I, I remember my first time getting this sandwich was probably March of this year actually. Are you sure gonna get one? Yeah I'm gonna get a chicken sandwich. If it's available. If it's available. It's like one of those things man. Like, you, you have to get it. Like you go it's, zippies you need to get at least the chili. <laughs> yeah or like you go jack in a box and you gotta get the curly fries. You know? uh -huh. I don't think the Popeyes order when you're ready. Okay thank you. We have secured the bag. These smokes. He wasn't playing around, boys. Yeah. Uh, chicken, dude. Chicken sandwich. Can and one that? chicken sandwich. <laughs> we can do this. So, um, I'm gonna do something exciting today. I don't know if it's legal or not, but shoot, we're going for it. We're gonna be riding up. I'm, I'm gonna be riding my bike. Uh, Martin's gonna be joining me. And, uh, I gotta head over to his house, drop off some weights to to his sister, pump up my wheels, and just check out my, make sure my bike's okay. Uh, we'll just like, get a really quick break. Uh, we'll see you at Martin's house. And um, and wait. Sweet Lord Jesus Christ. Here we are, the house of Supras. Martin. Long time no see. Long time no see, how you been? Good. On the way? Yeah, I bought it from Marlene. Wanna say hi to the camera? Hi. Hi. <laughs> this guy. Mr. Fancy with his fancy woodwork. Oh, this is the kinds of. Oh, fuck. Oh, I caught that on camera, dude. Twitter. Damn it. Pretty sick, my man. Looks pretty good. Since we're passing through Nimitz and it gets too wild, like I probably should probably use a road bike at that point. We can always just like cut it short at Lagoon Drive. Why? I mean, I'm just saying, like if it, if it gets worse. Sounds like you're fishing out. I don't know. Dude, I'm I'm just having a plan a plan B. My my That's goal. Plan B. My goal. I have goals here. Okay. My goal is to make it to town, Waikiki. And then yeah, make your, it back home. Yeah, your goal, your goal should be like not cutting short. That's not a goal, dude. Uh, Martin just got to my house, and we is ready to go, boys. Yeah. All right, holy shit! Here we go. Originally, I wanted this video to be somewhat an ASMR video because I was inspired by this person on YouTube. Um, but I figured it wouldn't be my style, so I kept it as a music video. But as an intro, uh, I used to bike to school back in college uh, when I went to University of Manoa. And I met a lot of people and went to something called TNRs. Uh, it's basically Thursday night ride and uh, you ride through town and it's just a bunch of people there. Kind of caught wind with Martin where uh, he rode, he used to build bikes when he was a kid as well and we kind of had this hobby together. We rode a hundred mile race uh, called the Honolulu Century Ride which is hosted by Hawaii Bicycle League. Uh, it was a ride that we would start off in Kapiolani and all the way through um, the east side to Kahalu and back. It, it, it was a very long ride and it was somewhat of an accomplishment that we had together. 
really really awesome ride so this ride we did is from my house in pearl city through nimitz to waikiki and to diamond head to kamuki and back uh it totaled about 40 miles and um it was a very tough ride as you know because i'm on single speed and we battled a bunch of hills i actually cramped up a few times which is pretty crazy uh later in this video you'll see me crash as well uh trying to avoid some people in the sand i just wanted to touch on one thing about the ride because i was nervous at first and martin he called he kind of called me out for bitching out and uh i kind of see that having a plan b is a setup for failure because you're already expecting to fail i mean having a plan b is good you can't just just have a plan b for it. you got to go for it and you can't stop just enjoy the ride and this is a really awesome part of the video where we're just cruising through waikiki and magic island and we were just in time just to reach the the sunset. All right, guys.
I mean, it is kind of sad that they are taking off a lot of the, the stuff on the menu. But, like, the Mexican pizza? Yeah, dude, like, I get that shit all the damn time. Like, yeah. every time I go. It's like 30 years old. 30 years old? Yeah. No, it's yeah. not. I think so. Like, Kim, or it originally came out in the 80s, I believe. And, then, like, they're just gonna take it off. <laughs> oh, someone's fucking up in management, yo. Yeah. Yeah, so, I invited Kaz to come over to my house to um cook some habanara habanara bugger the bugger the poop it's got to be with the freaking hand thing uh, <laughs> uh, i mean uh, bad is always good okay all right all right okay cool We are here. You sharpen it. I <laughs> Alright, we're gonna invest in a sharper knife. Easy. Easy. Oh, oh. Got a little eggshell in there. It's okay. <laughs> Can you them? Okay. Oh, you boy. Look guys, does it look good? 